generation is rising. Fresh oil. Fresh oil. Father, anoint every prophet. Anoint every pastor. Anoint every teacher. Father, let the fresh fire come upon a new generation. Let them be carriers of the glory, Lord. Use her in Jesus' name. I rebuke that lie of the enemy that says that God can't use women. I rebuke that religious spirit in the name of Jesus. of God is here. Get this guy right here with his Bible. Quick, 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 quick. Help him. Power of God is here, church. The power of God is present. There's such an anointing here. Turn him to me. Lord, use him. Stretch your hands forward, church. Use him. Oh, there's such a strong anointing here. Ask him to use you. Use me, Jesus. Use me, Jesus. Receive it in Jesus' name. Bring this lady here. Father, let fire fall. Fire in the name of Jesus. Whoa. That's the fire of God here. It's a fresh anointing present on this room. Can you guys feel that? Bring the guy in the gray sweatshirt. Such a strong anointing, guys. There's power in unity, church. There's power in unity. Use him, I pray, in Jesus' name. Spirit of the living. Use him, Lord, new levels, new levels. Prophet Angela, quickly, quickly, quickly. Hey, name of Jesus. He's here right now. He's here right now. Lord, touch this lady. I pray. Oh, did you guys see that? What did you feel go through you? Do it again, Lord, in Jesus' name. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Have Joshua and Yveth stand just a little right there. There you go. David, would you help us? A new season. A new season. A new season. New season. Fresh oil, fresh oil. You're stepping into it, my brother. You're stepping into it. You're stepping into it. Matt, stand right here, my friend. Lift your hands. Whoa. Wow. Matt, all I can tell you is he is so pleased with you. All I can tell you is he's so pleased with you. When you stepped in front of me right now, I sensed Jesus standing between us. There is coming on your meetings, my friend. The heavenly host joining you in worship. For you will stand in places of heavenly authority. And you will walk in that which Catherine Coleman walked in. 
You will walk in that which Oral Roberts walked in. For I send you not just as a voice to a people. He's sending you as a global voice. You will stand with eyes fixed on Jesus. One hand in heaven with your feet on earth. And glory, 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 even that which you feel now, the weight, the weight, the weight of that glory. Nathaniel, come onto the platform, please. Because you have sought to hide yourself, because you've said, Lord, I don't want a platform, I want your presence. Because you've said, Lord, I just want to please you, not people. Because you've been a bold voice to declare his word and only his word. God says, I will raise you and I'm not giving you a choice in the matter. God says, I will take you to heights and I'm not giving you a choice in the matter. Didn't you say, I'm yours? Didn't you say, do what you will? Didn't you say, I give you my all? Didn't you say, spend me for your glory? Therefore, God says, I will take you up on that offer, and I am going to raise you, for I am giving you the faith of Smith Wigglesworth. I am giving you the miracles of A.A. A. Allen. I am giving you a mantle for revival and repentance. Because you have humbled yourself before me, therefore I will raise you to places of influence, says the Spirit of God. A new generation is rising. Fresh oil. Fresh oil. Father, anoint every prophet. Anoint every pastor. Anoint every teacher and apostle. Bring Paul up here. Bring Paul. Paul, you've said within yourself, I don't know if I have what it takes. You've looked at other pastors, evangelists, and ministries, and you felt inferior thinking, I don't have that charisma. I don't have that gift. I don't have that ability. So what you've done is you've served. You've served and you've served. Impartation, not imitation. Because you have served, a portion now falls to you. Mantles are being released from heavenly places. Mantles are being released. Eric, Eric, mantles are being released. Mantles are being released. Heavenly, heavenly, heavenly mantles. My brother right here with the glasses. Come up here. You're crossing over now. You're crossing over now. You've said, Lord, I'm waiting, waiting, waiting. When you're ready, Lord, God's given you visions of you preaching. God's given you visions of laying hands on people and them falling under the power. God's given you visions of you casting out devils. Today receive. Today receive. It's a fresh oil. It's a fresh oil. It's a fresh oil. Sing it out to him. So Come on, every hand lifted in this place. I feel the Lord saying that. He is coming again, and I, I want every hand lifted because God is gonna mark you with boldness and with courage to carry this fire everywhere you go. Come on, every hand lifted right now. I wanna release a fresh anointing over you. Father, right now in the name of Jesus, I release the anointing of the Holy Ghost over them. God, I ask that you would ignite a holy fire. God, that you would stir within each
each and every one of us in this house tonight. God, the desire for purity, the desire for holiness. I believe that God tonight's gonna give many of you an awareness of who He is. He's gonna give many of you a new hatred for sin, a love for His Word. Come on, if you want that, lift your hands up right now. God, I release your fire right now. I release fresh passion, fresh zeal. And Jesus might, I rebuke every spirit of addiction right now. If you're struggling with addiction, lift up your hand. Wave your hand right now. Say, Holy Spirit, I say yes to you. Say, Holy Spirit, I say yes to you. I command every demon power to lose its grip off your life. I speak breakthrough and freedom in your heart, in every area of your heart. If you need breakthrough right now, receive it in Jesus' name. We bind every assignment of the enemy. We cancel it in Jesus' name. And I thank you, Lord, for fresh fire, fresh faith right now, fresh courage in Jesus' name. Some of you have been weary in this place. I see, I see the, the last three months you've been weary. You've been tired, and I see God giving you a second win tonight. I see about 50, that's for 50 of you here tonight. In the name of Jesus, I speak a second wind over you. I speak the Holy Ghost anointing over you to break every bondage of the enemy, every scheme, every attack. We come against it now in Jesus' name. Some of you want to encounter God. Some of you have been asking God to encounter you, even in your dreams. And I ask, Lord, that you would invade every area of their life. Invade every, encounter them, Lord, in such a way where they would never go back to how they were. But they would see with new eyes and they would hear with new ears. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Hallelujah. Lord, we just come in agreement. We come in agreement for a fresh passion, for a fresh passion, for a passion, for a passion for your presence, a passion for your glory, a passion for you, Lord, a passion for the secret place. God, we don't want to just come to events. We don't want to come to events. God, we want to have a relationship with you. Father, draw us to the secret place. Draw us to the secret place. To the secret place lord i pray that you'd begin to woo that you'd begin to woo that you'd begin to woo your church back to the secret place back to your heart that you'd begin to reignite the fire that was burnt out the fire that was burnt out in the name of jesus in the name of jesus set your church ablaze set your church ablaze Set your church ablaze, set your church ablaze. Let our hearts desire after you, Jesus. Let the cry of your church be, come Lord Jesus. Let it be as the Holy Spirit cries out. Come Lord Jesus, come Lord Jesus. Draw us, draw us to you, draw us to you. Some of you, I hear the Spirit of the Lord, the only time receive glory and presence is when you go to events and the Lord is saying to you I'm going to begin to draw you I'm going to begin to draw you into the secret place he's gonna begin to remove distractions He's going to begin to remove that entertainment that had your attention. In the name of Jesus, just raise up your hands. I feel the Lord. I feel the Lord. He's going to pour out a new passion over you. I'm going to count to three. One, two, three.
So Father, I thank you for your people now in Jesus' name. And Father, I thank you for a fire that would burn idolatry out of our hearts. Father, I thank you for the fire of first love being lit in the hearts of your people. Is not man's spirit the candle of the Lord? And so, Father, I thank you that the Holy Spirit is doing a work on the inside of your people. Father, I thank you the hype is leaving, and I thank you the anointing is coming. Father, I thank you you're drawing people from glory to glory to glory to glory. And Father, I thank you we will have one passion. I thank you we will have one love, and it will be Jesus and Jesus alone. And Father, I thank you that all the bondage of the enemy in the mind Father, I thank you for the, the anointing that breaks the yoke in the name of Jesus. And Lord, I pray that you would fill every heart with your presence and that you would come in this room in a fresh way and that in their secret place and in their private time that they wouldn't read their Bibles and say words to the wall. But I pray, Jesus, you would walk into that room. And I pray, Jesus, you would touch your people. And I pray, Jesus, you would reveal yourself as the lover of their souls. And they would find rest and satisfaction in you and you alone. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus that you'd fill every hungry heart in this place. In Jesus' name, Lord, let your fire burn every single thing within us, Lord, that does not belong in our hearts, in our souls. Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus, Lord, that you would rid everything that is not of you, everything that is demonic, everything that is secular, Lord, that takes our time away from you, Lord. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus that you would set your church on fire again, that you'd set Set us ablaze. Lord, we pray for revival in California in the name of Jesus that every soul, every person that doesn't know you, that doesn't declare you as Lord, Lord, that you'd use your church, that you'd use the men and the women and the children that are in this place today. Use them around the world. Use them in their neighborhoods, Lord, in their neighbors, in their schools, in their workplaces. Father, I pray that what you've given them tonight, Lord, that it would not go to waste. Lord, that it would not just be dropped on the ground as they leave this place, but Lord, that they would be carriers, carriers, carriers of the glory of God. Lord, that everywhere they go, it will be a representation that you are alive, that you are well, that you are the King of kings and the Lord of lords. Father, I pray that even this week, even this month, that you will give them opportunities to lay hands on the sick, that you will give them opportunities to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ, that they will see the fruit and the power of the gospel within their own mouth, within their own hand, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And worthy, worthy is the Worthy is the Lamb, you are holy, holy, are you Lord God Almighty? Sing it out, worthy is the Lamb, worthy is the Lamb, worthy is the Lamb. You Thank you for watching Encounter TV. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Also, help us spread the gospel of Jesus Christ in the power of the Holy Spirit. Make a one-time donation or become a monthly supporter by clicking on the donate link now.